Hey guys, this is Warrior Cool Four. I'm bringing you a short guide on basically how to fix the mass acceleration inside Far Cry 4. Uh, this work for me got rid of it completely. I've heard it doesn't do the same for others. Um, I'm sorry if it doesn't work for you, but it worked for me. It will definitely work for a lot of other people. Hopefully it's you. It really also just depends on what system you're running as well and how well you can actually run the game. Me, I can run it, you know, solid, perfectly fine. It works perfect. Um, so this is how you basically get rid of it. First thing you can do is if you if you have Steam, Ubisoft, you really don't need to worry about this too much. Uh, but for people who stream, go ahead and go click on the game in your folders and go to properties. You want to go to set launch options and you want to put in this command right here inside there. You won't see anything inside here as it is, but you put this inside there, which is dash no force MXL. That should disable it in game, but for what some people know is when you turn it off in game it's still kind of there it's really odd but that right there disables that through in game and it should help a little bit uh, now to get rid of it completely the next thing you, you don't even have to do that but the next thing you do definitely do because this will help this is what should help you you can go inside the your full your files and go into documents for me, it's in my games. It may just be right here, but what you're looking for is the Far Cry 4 folder it, through your documents, not through Steam. That's different. Now, this may be inside your Steam documents. I've heard people finding this folder inside their Steam. Um, for me, it was right here in the documents. I couldn't find it in Steam, and I was kind of getting pissed because I didn't know where it was, but it was right here in my documents. It may be in your documents too, if it is awesome. If it isn't, then it's inside your Steam folders, which to get to that, you can just right click on here, go to properties, local files, and then you can browse the local files. And it should be in here somewhere, just kind of browse through, but if not, then I have no idea. If it's not in here, it has to be in your documents though. That's what I'm, that's what I'm telling you right now. Okay, so, yes, once you hear you click on the Far Cry 4 folder, uh, click on this odd name folder right here and then you'll see gamer profile and it's a XML document uh, you want to open it with notepad because the other thing is like a website link and it's very odd it does not work off the bat you will see mouse acceleration it and mouse acceleration on you want to change those both from 1 to 0 this one was already set to 0 as I did but probably because of the command and I started the game with the command um, but this right here should greatly fix it pretty much. Uh, the next thing you want to do is uh, scroll down and you'll see a little bit a little bit of ways down smoothness and smoothness underscore iron sight. Change those both from one to zero because that also helps as awesome mouse acceleration. It helps a lot and fixes it basically. And yeah so you can go ahead and save and close out of that and that should fix it okay, well if if you're running this through Ubisoft as I was saying you can't do any set launch options as far as I know of course I don't use the Uplay uh, I don't use Uplay that much as you can see I just have three games that I run through Uplay this one basically runs from Steam through Uplay into the game it's odd but yeah if you have Uplay, just do what I did with the documents. That's your best hope right there. It should work. It should completely work. You don't even really have to worry about this. E even for Steam users, you don't have to worry about setting it in the launch options and all that stuff because you're going to turn it off through the files anyways. But I turned it off. I don't know if it's helping. It may be, but I, I just did it just in case, just for the heck of it, just to be, you know, overkill with it. So if this helped you, then go ahead and leave a like. Uh, if it didn't, if you're having maybe a little bit of problems finding the folder, then go ahead and comment and um, uh, either I or people in the comments may also help you find it. But, you know, because people on YouTube sometimes pretty cool guys. Uh, yeah, so that's how you fix that for now. Uh, unless Ubisoft does something with a patch that, you know, fucks it up because, you know, they can do that. They'll, they'll do whatever they want. They're Ubisoft. Uh, so yeah, I hope this helped you. It helped me. If not, then I'm sorry, but you might just have to wait for a patch. So yeah, thanks for watching and 